guys and welcome to some advanced warfare today I'm going to be showing you the royalty camo on all the six different assault rifles first of all there is seven different camo challenges you have to complete before you get the diamond camo once you have unlocked the, di the diamond camo on all the six assault rifles that's when you unlock the royalty camo first there are 80 long shots to get the long shots I would recommend you to play hardcore game, game modes. Also, for the strafe medals, I recommend you to play hardcore game types. And put on the red dot sight so it is easier to be accurate. Hardcore requires less shots on target, and therefore it is much easier to get long shots. Moving on to the headshots, you have to get 80 headshots as well. You have to aim for the head. You have to aim higher than you normally do. After one or two matches, this you will get used to this. Moving on to the third challenge. You have to get 40 strafe medals. As I said before, I recommend you to play hardcore game modes. Of course, you have to jump a lot. And maybe put on the hover ability. And then it is the bloodthirsties. You don't have to try to get these. They will come naturally. The fifth challenge is to get 40 kills shortly after dodging. That means using your exo ability or your exo movement to dodge forward or to the sides. This will also come naturally. Just like the 150 kills with no perks equipped and the 200 kills with no attachments. I personally like to do this at the same time. But of course, it's up to you. But that's all guys. Thank you for watching the video. Please drop a like if you enjoyed the video and if you could use 2 seconds to hit that subscribe button I would be so thankful. And let me know if you think the royalty camo is really cool or if it suck balls.